guys, this is Billy from NHC. When we talk about study abroad, of course, we all want to get scholarships. Besides the pride, it will also help us to minimize the financial burden. So in China, what are included in the scholarships? First, let's talk about full scholarship. Actually, it's a very general term. It covers tuition, boarding fee, living expenses, and medical insurance. There are different types of full scholarship. And for partial scholarship, it means it covers part of the four elements. So some of you may ask how much money is involved for full scholarship. Actually, this is a very tough question to answer because different schools have different tuitions and boarding fees. For tuition, it's roughly in the range of 25,000 to 35,000 RMB per year. And for boarding fees, around 10,000 to 20,000 per year. For the living expense support, it can go up to 2,500 RMB for the bachelor students, 3,000 RMB for the master students, and 3,500 for the doctor students. Again, this is the maximum support the scholarship can support. For medical insurance, the annual fee is around 800 RMB per year. Sounds complicated, right? No problem. Let me help to do a quick calculation. If you were a bachelor student and you got full scholarship, so after four years, you can save 37,000 to 50,000 US dollars. Sounds attractive, right? But I need to emphasize scholarship is given to the elite students instead of the people who need financial support only. Therefore, in order for you to get scholarship, you have to have good academic results. Also, after you arrived in China, you must study hard. If you skip classes, fail in exams, violate school regulations, or even do criminal activities, there's a great chance the school will terminate the scholarship. Okay, so if you want to know more about different scholarship programs and you cannot wait to apply now, please contact us, okay? And also like this video and follow our account.